30 long days. Over 300 trucks entered. Over 200 races. And we have finally come to the day where it all comes to an end. Today is the finale for the Super King of the Hill 3 Oversize. My guys and gals, this was the first ever year of doing a Super King of the Hill Monster Truck event. And let me tell you what, it went off with a bang. I had a lot of fun with it. I know you guys did as well. I saw the views, I saw the likes and all the comments and I cannot thank you guys and gals enough. So now, it is time to wrap it up with one of the greatest spectacles in racing here on YouTube. An annual event we hold every year here on July 4th. So happy July 4th. I hope you guys are ready for this finale. I know I am. We're celebrating a potential new king or a potential three-time king here on the channel as well as our Independence Day. Man, oh man. Which one are you going to have more fun with? Exactly. Yes, let's kick it off the right way with some good races. Oh my gosh, we're gonna head it. We're gonna head to Trackside. I'm gonna say we we're heading. I, I don't even know where I was going with that. It's been so long since uh, I've done an intro where it's just off the cuff like this. Uh, but yeah, we're here. We're excited. Kind of. You guys excited? I'm excited. Hey, I don't want to drag out this intro too long. We need to get trackside and get our pre-race ceremonies underway, including the national anthem. Then after that, we're going to come back here. We're going to fire the engines, and then we're going to get to racing. So let's go ahead, head to trackside, and get our national anthem underway for the Super King of the Hill 3 oversized finale here on July 4th. Let's go. Oh. Say can you see, by the dawn's early light, what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight, or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming, and the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh say, does that star-spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the brave. Oh my gosh, you love a good flyover. The national anthem has concluded. Now it is time for the most famous words in all of motorsports. Oh my gosh, let's do it. I need to, I need to, I need something. I need something real quick. I'll be right back. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't know what I need. I don't know what I need. What do I need? Oh gosh, oh gosh. Anywho, anywho, I can't find what I need. But anywho, drivers, start your engines! Oh, what an amazing opening ceremony. You always get goosebumps when we have a flyover. Guys and gals, the lineups are set. This is single elimination for the finale. Made the best truck win. Now, to start off, it will be single trucks, but as we go into round number two, we will be racing them three wide. Like I said, this is going to be one of the best tournaments uh, one of the best tournament finales we have ever held here on the channel. Like I said, we are racing under the lights. Oh my gosh. So this is an all new track setup for these guys. It's going to be cooler in here. It's not going to be as hot. So they are going to be gripped up for speed. One camera, the finish line camera. And oh my gosh, this finale is going to be insane. Guys, if you are ready, do me a solid smash that like button down below. Drop a comment letting me know you are here for the scoff finale. I'm excited. Let's kick it off. Ah, 30 trucks have come alive and they are ready to race. But before we get this event truly kicked off and get racing under the lights, we're going to go ahead and thank the pit crew members here on YouTube. Guys, thank you so much for the continued support. You guys have like stars next to your name now. I did not do that. 
I don't know if that's something YouTube did, but yeah, very cool. If you guys like to become a pit crew member, you can find those links down below. Two ninety nine a month. They do help support the channel and put on shows just like this. Or thank you to my Patreon members. Thank you so very much for the continued support. The guys with the Patreon members, they get three different tiers to choose from. All linked down below. Now, we thank the people who support this show. Outside of you, fine folks watching at home and liking, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. That's just as good to me. Thank you so very much for all the support here, you guys. Now, let's go back trackside and get it underway. And kicking off this monstrous finale, you got Mega Rex taking on Steer Clear. All right, he was going to be the first truck advancing. We are racing under the lights for the Super King of the Hill 3 oversized finale. Let's go. We're starting off strong with two wide at the line, but the Mega Rex, our former king of the hill, is moving on. All right, race number two just pulled up. It's Dairy Delivery taking on Will Trash It All. Oh, man, the atmosphere feels good. It's nice and cool. These trucks are so sticky. Oh, man, I don't know where I was going with that. I meant to say grippy, but somehow we got to sticky. It doesn't matter. Let's go. Dairy Delivery coming out strong. He has to take on Mega Rex in the next round. Up next on the finale, you got the Mecha Orca taking on Pure Muscle. So far, all the winners have come from lanes one and two. I think those are the most gripped up lanes. Here we go. Just kidding, I was testing the waters with some theories. Ah, uh, Pure Muscle gets it done and moves on. Just like that, we are three races deep into this finale and we already have our first race for the next round set up. All right, our next race is rolling in. You got the Jurassic World T-Rex Dairy Delivery taking on Demo Derby. So far, the heavyweights have been ruling today's competition. Let's go. Demo Derby went down hard. The T-Rex is moving on. Coming up next is Raphael in Will Trash It All taking on Pure Muscle. All right, Raph and Pure Muscle. Let's go. Pure Muscle taking down the dump truck. Well, garbage truck. Pure Muscle's moving on. All right, next up we're getting into the Spin Master lot. You got Wildfire taking on the Big Kahuna. All right, two really fast trucks. Who's moving on to the next round of the finale? Let's go. doubt about it come on now wildfires moving on all right let's get the next race lined up it's the yeti taking on whiplash all right we know yeti's big and heavy 
But Whiplash, she's an underdog. Let's go. Dog that had nothing for the mighty Yeti. Up next is going to be Radical Rescue taking on the Megalodon. All right, both of these trucks came in here as underdogs. They both left winning their qualifying days. Who's moving on to the next round? Let's go. Lanes one and two are juiced up. Radical Rescue is moving on. Race number nine of this tournament brings us to Freebird taking on the Dragon. Can Freebird join Wildfire in the next round? Let's go! Freebird flew like an eagle. They're moving on. All right, coming up next, you got Monster Mutt Poodle taking on Snakebite. All right, here we go. We know Monster Mutt Poodle is a beast. Can Snakebite take him down? Let's go. Truly is no competition when it comes to Hot Wheels versus Spin Master. Snakebite, moving on. Up next, you got the Red, White, and Bigfoot taking on the Volkswagen Drag Bus. All right, the Red, White, and Bigfoot is up against a heck of an opponent. Let's go. something to happen to the drag bus. Bigfoot comes back and takes it. You will rarely see a drag bus go down. Red, white, and Bigfoot moving on. All right, here we go. This is a race you're not going to want to miss. It's Mega Rex taking on Recreational. All right, which one of these trucks is going to be the best of the best? Here we go. No doubt about that. Recreational gets the victory. Oh man, they see a crown in sight. Three races remain in this first round. Up first, it's the T-Rex taking on the Monster Rig. Now I know we think the T-Rex is going to win, but that Monster Rig could easily come back and get a victory because anything can happen here at the Hauler. Let's go. Well, not anything, but you know, T-Rex is moving on. All right, up next is the Prodigal Son Town Hauler taking on the OG Gravedigger. All right, Town Hauler, do not let me down. You are the face of Hawkeye Hauler. Let's go. Oh, 
Oh man, and this is why you're quickly becoming my favorite town hauler. You never let me down. And the last race of this first round brings us to the Mecha Mega Rex taking on Captain's Curse. All right, who's gonna get that final spot in the next round? Here we go. a little bit longer trek. I think Captain's Curse would have taken down the Mecha Mega Rex, but just not today. The Mecha Mega Rex is moving on. 15 trucks have gone home. 15 trucks remain. All right, it's time to take a quick merch drop break and we'll be right back to racing. I told you guys new merch was dropping today. I am so excited about this merch. Guys, here it is right here on your screen several different options to choose from this is the third annual scoff uh, commemorative t-shirt sweatshirt whatever you want to call it guys if you'd like to purchase this shirt and help support the channel it is the top link down below it doesn't look like a typical url link it's a i think it just says third annual scoff or something like that it's the first link down below it should be underlined just go ahead and click on it it will take you to my teespring store and it will take you right to the page you need if you'd like to purchase a a, uh, a t-shirt. Last year we had the uh, I Survived the Scoth and all I got with this lousy shirt and uh, that didn't go over too well so I wanted to revamp it this year and uh, hopefully this design fits your fancy. I, I personally like it so uh, hopefully you guys do as well. Anywho, top link down below help support your boy. Alright, let's get back to the track and uh, get some more racing underway. I believe the first round just concluded so uh, on to the second round. We are getting closer to that king round Who's it gonna be, baby? Who's it gonna be? There's a bug there. I, it flew away. I thought I killed it. Uh, <laughs> and definitely go pick up that merch, Hawkeye Holler Nation. I, I, I really like it. Hopefully you guys do as well. All right, welcome to the round of 15. We're ready to race. From here, we will see a final five trucks. Oh my gosh, who's it gonna be? Single elimination still. Man, three wide. Here we go. All right, kicking off this three wide smorgasbord, you got our former King Mega Rex, Dairy Delivery, and Pure Muscle. Remember, this is one and done. First truck to the finish line moves on to the round of five. Go. with a thunderous crash here at the end. Dairy Delivery is moving on. Who will be joining Dairy Delivery in the next round? Will it be the T-Rex Dairy Delivery, Pure Muscle, or Wildfire? Oh man, we could see two Dairy Deliveries battling it out in the next round. Let's go. crash for dairy delivery you guys saw that in real time but pure muscles moving on piece number three of the round of 15 it's yeti radical rescue and Freebird. who's gonna be the first spin master truck advancing let's go Wide at the line, Hawkeye Holler Nation. Freebird got it done. All right, let's kick off the next race. Snakebite, the Red, White, and Bigfoot, and Recreational. I really think we know who has this in the bag. Let's go. Good 
goodness gracious, recreational by a country mile is moving on. And our final race of this round of 15, he got the T-Rex, Town Hauler, and the Mecha Mega Rex. One spot remains in the round of five. Let's go. Town Hollers going home. Sad, sad day. Mecha Mega Rex is moving on. Five trucks remain. It's time for another quick break and we will be right back. Now I know, I know, I know, I talk about this all the time, but guys, if you guys are not following me on Instagram or TikTok, or if you're not following the official Hawkeye Holler Discord, what are you guys really doing? Really, go follow me over on Instagram. I, I drop pictures over there. Sometimes over on my stories, you guys see a little bit behind the scenes of what I'm doing in my personal life. So yeah, it is linked down below. And of course, you know, TikTok, we are racing over on TikTok. Even though TikTok's buggy and uh, I don't really like it over there, I don't know how long I will continue that. Uh, I say that all the time with TikTok. I get on there, have fun with it for a couple weeks, and then uh, it just starts to go downhill because TikTok is uh, toxic as, uh, yeah. We'll leave the expletive out of this. But TikTok is very toxic. To toxic. Toxic TikTok. TikTok toxic. Yeah. Anywho. And if you're not on the Discord, the free Discord, I must say, the only Discord we have, the official Hawkeye Holler Discord, it's linked down below. Go chat it up the other Hot Wheels and Diecast fanatics. Come on, you guys. Come on. Go join the Discord. We need more people on the Discord to chat with. All right. Back to the track. I believe we're heading into the round of five now. I believe. Anywho. We're getting closer to the king round. Stick around. Like the video. You guys heard the man. Go follow those links. They're all down below. All right. So the first race of this round of five will be dairy delivery and pure muscle. And then we will have the three round. Oh my gosh. The three round. That's not what I meant. The three wide race. Oh my gosh. I've had so much fun this tournament. You guys, I hope you have as well. Who is moving on to the contender round? All right, it's going to be Dairy Delivery and Pure Muscle to start us off for this round of five. Dairy Delivery has been in a contender round before. Pure Muscle never has. Who's it going to be? That said, lane two, it doesn't matter. All you have to do is trigger the gate. You do not have to cross the threshold on the King of the Hill tournaments. Dairy Delivery is moving on to the contender round. But who's going to be joining him? Will it be Freebird, Recreational, or the Mecha Mega Rex? The final three wide race of this event here. We go. No doubt about it. Recreational is moving on to the contender round. I told you they're looking at that crown. They're hungry. Oh, Hawkeye Holler Nation, the contender round is set. Dairy Delivery, recreational. This is a first truck to win two. Moves on to take on the king in the king round. This is going to be a bloodthirsty battle between these two. Lane one is definitely the money lane, but I don't think that matters to recreational. Here we go. Recreational gets it done first. They need one more win. If Dairy Delivery can come back and get a victory, we will go into a backwards breaking tiebreaker. Here we go. Just 
just like that, the contender round has concluded. Recreational will meet the king in the king round. Oh, Hawkeye Holler Nation, the time has come. It is time for the Super King of the Hill Oversized King Round. Our contender, Recreational. Our current Monster Truck King of the Hill, Five Alarm, are set to do battle in this best of three. First truck to win two to wrap up the Super King of the Hill. Oh my gosh. Say it with me one final time. Who's it gonna be? Always the king gets lane advantage. He chose the inside lanes closest to the wall. I guess those would be the outside lanes. Inside's closest to me. Anywho, Five Alarm has chosen the inside lanes. They seem to be the money lanes, but that does not matter to recreational. It really doesn't. I think this tournament is all said and done. Here we go. Recreational strikes first. They got that first win. Five alarm is in jeopardy. Recreational needs one more win. They can see that crown in sight. Here we go. It's over. It's over. It's not over. It is not over. That was a double DNF for both trucks. Gate three was triggered. You, it, you have to trigger the gate, yes, but it has to be in your lanes. One and two or five and six. Gate three was triggered. We're going to re-rack them and do it again. It's still one to nothing. Can the king make a comeback? Here we go. The king has fallen. Five Alarm will not become a three-time king of the hill. Recreational has dethroned them. Oh my gosh. It's been a long time coming for Recreational. They've been trying so very long. And guess what? They are officially a king of the hill here on Hawkeye Holler. Guys, let's go ahead and take a look at the drivers and go ahead and congratulate them in the comments down below. A lot of people picked recreational, rightfully so. Here you are on top of the grandstands. Well, technically the grandstands are back there, but anywho, you guys, you feel me, you feel me. Recreational is the brand new king. On top of the king shelf, recreational goes, how long will they remain monster truck king? Oh yeah, and guess what? The Rainbow Road King of the Hill is coming next. All right, Hawkeye Holler Nation, that's a wrap here for racing. Let's send it back upstairs and wrap up this video. Oh God, it's been a, it's been a long day. We've had tons of racing under the lights. We saw a new king crowned. We saw one go home. I really thought Five Alarm would have had something for him, especially there at the end with that controversial second race. Five Alarm, you just didn't show up. You didn't show up. But anywho, if you guys enjoyed this finale, this conclusion to the legendary event we hold every year known as the Super King of the Hill, which will be back next year, and it will be oversized again. Think how many monster trucks we can jam in next year. This wasn't even the full collection. I could have raced more trucks per day and still had plenty left over. So next year, next year's going to be big. Also, I know you guys were expecting fireworks, but... uh. I tried that with sparklers and uh, my alarm went off, my fire alarm. Yeah, that's why there was no fireworks. If, I, uh, if you guys see fireworks in this video, it's me standing outside watching my neighbors act like they're Disney or Universal outside. Yeah, 
But anywho, guys, drop a like on the video, drop a comment down below. Don't forget to congratulate that new King Recreational and all the drivers who chose them. With that being said, like I said, if you'd like to help support your boy, it truly would mean a lot to me, but you're not obligated to do so. I do have pit crew memberships, $2.99 a month, three cheers to Patreon, the new merch that just dropped, everything is linked down below. Go follow me over on Instagram, TikTok, Discord, is all linked down below. Thank you so much for watching. I had a lot of fun with the Super King of the Hill 3 oversize. I cannot wait until the Super King of the Hill 4 next year in 2023. Guys, I will see you here. Let's see you back here very soon. I don't know what we're going to do. I know I said the Tournament of Kings was kicking off July 5th, but I think we're going to push that probably about a month, two months out. Maybe that will be the big event we have before our Halloween event. Uh, yeah, we'll figure it out. Could take a few days off. I've been filming nonstop for the past month. Been having a lot of fun with it, but just gonna take a little bit of break, but I will be back. Peace, love, and Hot Wheels. See you guys back here at the hauler for another monstrous video. Bye-bye, get out of here. Don't forget to like the video. Really, just one like. Well, it's just one click. One click. One click.